He's the man known as Pretty Boy, Money, and the self-proclaimed best ever. Love him or hate him, Floyd Mayweather Jr. is one of boxing's all-time greats. DAZN dives into the numbers behind his sensational career. We'll start with the big one, or rather, the non-existent one. Mayweather had zero losses across his 50-fight career. And still the undefeated champion of the world, Floyd Money Mayweather. Mayweather is the only man to have beaten Mexican superstar Canelo Alvarez, thanks to his 2013 victory. He also handed Diego Corrales and Ricky Hatton their first pro defeats. Of the top five most lucrative pay-per-view fights of all time, Mayweather was involved in four, with his bouts against Conor McGregor, Manny Pacquiao, Oscar De La Hoya, and Canelo generating an estimated $1.25 billion. Money is one of five men to have won world titles in five different weight classes, alongside Thomas Hearns, Sugar Ray Leonard, De La Hoya, and Pacquiao, with Mayweather having beaten the last two of them. You are watching absolutely one of the greatest fighters in the history of boxing. This is history in the making. This kid, I'm beginning to believe, more and more, might be the greatest fighter that ever lived. Pretty Boy is one of seven world champions in the last quarter century to go out with a perfect record. But of those seven, he has the best record, beating out the 46-0 Joe Calzaghe, who in turn is way ahead of Spenaki's 34. You're watching one of the greatest boxers in the history of this sport. You're watching the biggest event in the history of this sport and every other sport. 12 of Mayweather's final 13 fights came at the iconic MGM Grand as he made Las Vegas his home. It's my pleasure to welcome you to Las Vegas, Nevada in the United States of America and to the fabulous MGM Grand Garden Arena for this mega fight, World Championship Boxing at its finest moment. Mayweather grew into a more methodical fighter, but started out as a knockout king. Of his 27 career knockouts, he racked up 13 in his first 15 fights, which came before he'd even turned 22 years old. A rookie mistake, and Floyd Mayweather has done it. Against Canelo, Mayweather had 13 years and 144 days on the Mexican, marking the biggest difference in age of Money's career when he was the older man. You can't believe the anticipation, folks, in this crowd. And I'm just not a good enough sportscaster to be able to translate, but I can tell you what I'm feeling. I get goosebumps in my arms. The hair is standing up on my neck. The crowd is electrified. And now here comes the man that makes it all possible, Floyd Mayweather Jr. Pretty Boy holds an incredible record of 26 consecutive wins in world title fights, which is one more than the great Julio Cesar Chavez managed. Got it, folks. Do you like it? I love it. Hatton held the best perfect record of any Mayweather opponent at 43-0. But Money was at his evasive best in the 2007 fight, allowing Hatton to connect with just 17% of his punches for the copy box. Left hook drops him! And then he hit his head off the turnbuckle, and he's very, very wobble. A left hook came like a bolt out of the blue. This is the beginning of the end. Down he goes all over. The fight is over. Floyd Mayweather has stopped Ricky Hatton in the 10th round. Mayweather landed 46% of his punches against Canelo in 2013. The closest anyone has come is Triple G, and even he could only connect with 31%. I don't see any, any deterioration in his skills whatsoever, because he's never been hit. And that's exactly the way Mayweather fights. That's why I said he's the greatest defensive fighter that ever lived. 